looking ahead now to another exciting event, Alternating Currents. Kyle Dickens is joining us now with some exciting news, and Kyle, performances will have an extra set of eyes on them from America's Got Talent. Yeah, how about that, Morgan? Alternating Currents is back in the Quad Cities August 15th through the 18th, and this year it's going to be a whole lot different. A casting producer from America's Got Talent is coming to the Quad Cities. An AGT producer will be here scouting for talent amongst hundreds of performances across more than two dozen venues. And joining us now is Luke yeah. Swinney. Yeah. He is an AGT casting producer and joins us live via Zoom. Luke, we're so excited to welcome America's Got Talent here in August. What is it about the Alternating Currents Festival that's inspiring you to visit our Quad Cities? Oh my gosh, I mean, we're so excited to visit. Um, there's so many different types of acts that are going to be there. The Midwest is such a great location. I'm really excited to get out to Davenport and just see everything that's going on there. Yeah, heck yeah. So what type of talent will you specifically be looking for? What's some of the uh, different uh, types that you guys are seeking out? Definitely, I mean, our our kind of motto is any age, any talent, any dream. So literally can be anyone can be perfect for our show. Um, talents, we have singers, dancers, magicians, variety acts, truly anyone. Um, and you don't have to be a professional of any of these things to join our show. We love to meet just real genuine people who love doing what they do and um, they could be perfect for our show. Oh, that's awesome. Well, you, you kind of hit, hinted at this a little bit, but in addition to great talent, what else are you looking for in a performer? Yeah, I think there's a lot that goes into it, of course. Um, you know, stage presence and just being, you know, someone that everyone will get behind and root for is fantastic. Um, also, we are, us and our judges really look for people who really want this i mean um this you, this has changed so many people's lives in the past and it, there's a lot of opportunities here um that can be taken advantage of if you're if you join our show so we're really excited to kind of see who will be next um we're, we have a fantastic season going right now and we're already working on next season that's awesome now you know let's switch gears a little bit we'd love to hear a little bit more about your professional journey you know what does it take to become a producer for america's got talent uh, it's definitely the most wild and strange job I've ever had, but <laughs> the most fun at the same time. Um, I grew up in Texas um, just loving watching reality television, and um, I ended up going to school for it and moving to Los Angeles, but I, I specifically remember watching season one of America's Got Talent, and oh, next yes. year we're going into season 20, so um, it's going to be a really exciting year, but I, watching that first season and just seeing the amazing talents that America has to offer and how our show has evolved over time is just super cool. Sure. Um, so yeah, it, it's truly the dream job. I get to meet interesting people every single day. Um, so and I'm excited to see what Iowa has to offer. <laughs> That's awesome. Well, and so since, uh, you know, season one was kind of your first season that you got really hooked on it, there have been so many great performers on America's Got Talent over the years. Do you have a favorite act or which story that inspired you the most out of all those? Yeah, definitely. I mean, there's it's such a tough question because we truly have so many. Um, I mean, you can look at even our our winner last season, Adrian the Hurricane, was a dog act. And then <laughs> the year before that, we had a dance act and then a magician. I mean, there's just so many different types of talents inspire me. Um, this season specifically, the kids are rocking it this year. I mean, they're having so much fun and they're just the most talented kids that I've seen on the show. Um, we had our youngest contestant ever on the show. Two kids also got the golden buzzer this year. Um, so they're truly um, really inspiring me and they're kind of the next generation of talent. And I like that they're getting to showcase that talent on our stage. That, that's awesome. And the last question here is, you know, Luke, AGT is preparing for season 20 auditions and you can audition on the website too. There's all sorts of ways that people can get in the mix here. Yes, please do. AGTAuditions.com. That is the, uh, you know, our, our casting hub for sure. We have a virtual um, auditions on August 2nd that you can sign up for, which is fantastic. And then you also can always submit a video online on AGTAuditions.com. Um, and then also you can nominate an act this year. So if you have 
a friend, if your teacher, if your bus driver, or you just see a cool video online of someone that you think could be perfect for America's Got Talent, you can submit them on our sta- on our website. So, um, yeah, there's so many different ways to kind of get involved this year. That is super awesome. We appreciate your time. Thanks for joining us, Luke. And we look forward to welcoming you here to the Quad Cities come August. All right, Kyle, thank you. And you can watch America's Got Talent tonight right here on TV6 at 7 p.m. You can also catch up on the show by heading to NBC.com slash America's Got Talent. And of course, as Luke just mentioned, that's where you can also submit virtual auditions. Still